Hello friends, it's official, we have finished the quiet time of the sun's last 11 year cycle which ended in December 2019. On September 15, NASA and the USA's National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration announced the beginning of the new solar cycle number 25. Sunspots, flares and coronal mass ejections are expected to increase in the coming years, leading to maximum sun activity in 2025. Based on modelling, the peak of the solar activity is expected to be in July 2020 with 115 sunspots estimated to appear. Wow! However, the new sun cycle is predicted to be the same strength as the cycle before, number 24. Solar activities are expected to re-emerge in the higher latitudes of the sun. After the September equinox, we certainly saw an example of this when a seam of coronal holes formed near the top of the sun. I photographed a flare using my phone and then afterward experienced the tiring effects of the solar wind that streamed to earth. I made two videos about the solar activities and I'll leave the links in the description box below. As the new cycle progresses, the sun's action is expected to shift from the top down towards the equator. Before July 2025, the NOAA will launch a new satellite to help detect coronal mass ejections and monitor extreme activity. The sun is switching on for the next stage in Earth's ascension. Our opportunity to receive high frequency energy, light codes and solar support is escalating from now. In my next video, I'll talk about ascension and aligning with the new sun cycle. I hope you can join me again. Take care. Love to all. Ashley.